us worship and fall down before Christ himself, our King and our God. Come, let us worship and fall down before him. In peace, let us pray to the Lord. Lord For the peace from above and the salvation of our souls, let us pray to the Lord. Lord For the peace of the whole world, the welfare of the holy churches of God, and for the union of all, let us pray to the Lord. For this holy house and those who enter it with faith, reverence, and the fear of God, let us pray to the Lord. For his beatitude, our metropolitan Tikon, for his eminence, our Archbishop Alexander, for the honorable priesthood, the diaconate in Christ, for all the clergy and the people, let us pray to the Lord. For this country, its president, for all those in civil authority, and for the armed forces, let us pray to the Lord. For this city and every city and countryside, and the faithful dwelling in them, let us pray to the Lord. 
for seasonable weather, for abundance of the fruits of the earth, and for peaceful times, let us pray to the Lord. For travelers by land, by sea, and by air, for the sick and the suffering, for captives and our salvation, let us pray to the Lord. That we may be delivered from all affliction, wrath, danger, and necessity, let us pray to the Lord. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O God, by thy grace. Commemorating our most holy, most pure, most blessed and glorious Lady Theotokos and ever-Virgin Mary with all the saints, let us commend ourselves and each other in all our life unto Christ our God. For unto thee are due all glory, honor, and worship to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. again and again in peace let us pray to the Lord help us save us have mercy on us and keep us O God by thy grace 
commemorating our most holy, most pure, most blessed and glorious Lady Theotokos and ever Virgin Mary with all the saints, let us commend ourselves and each other and all our life unto Christ our God. For thine is the might and thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages. and send our return of thine grace and the gift of the Holy Spirit. Voice of my prayer when I go upon thee.
and deliver us from all those things which seek to ensnare us in the friendly and sorrow. Do not put us to shame, for unto thee are due all glory, honor, and worship. To the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Wisdom, let us attend. Having come to the setting of the sun. Attend peace beyond all wisdom. The Prochemenon is in the sixth tone. The Lord is king, he is robed in majesty. The Lord is robed with strength and has girded himself. For he hath made the world so sure that it shall not be moved. Holiness becometh thine house, O Lord, on the length of days. The Lord is King. Let us attend. Wisdom, let us attend.
wisdom. Let us attend. Let us all say with all our soul, with all our mind, let us say. O Lord Almighty, the God of our fathers, we pray thee, hearken and have mercy. Have mercy on us, O God, according to thy great mercy, we pray thee, hearken and have mercy. Again, we pray for our Metropolitan Tecon, for our Archbishop Alexander, and for all our brethren in Christ. Mercy, Lord. Again, we pray for this country, its president, for all civil authorities, and for the armed forces. Again, we pray for the blessed and ever-memorable Holy Orthodox Patriarchs and for the blessed and ever-memorable founders of this Holy Church, for the newly departed handmaid of God, Susanna, and for all our fathers and brethren, the Orthodox, the part of this life before us, who here in all the world lie asleep in the Lord. Again, we pray for mercy, life, peace, health, salvation, and visitation for the servants of God, Camden, Rachel, Mary, Maurice, Katie, Linnea, George, George, Plato, Eliza, Margaret, Millie, Mariana, Kimberly, Paul, Amanda, Trey, Bridget, Ray, Esme, Mariana, Jeff, Shatul, Mira, Chris, Jean, and Linda, and for... Vesaliki and for the brethren of this holy temple and for the pardon and remission of their sins. Again, we pray for those who bring offerings and do good works in this holy and all venerable temple, for those who labor and those who sing, and all the people here present who await thy great and rich mercy. For thou art a merciful God and lovest mankind, and unto thee do we send up glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Praising glorified is thy name. Amen. Let thy mercy be upon us, O Lord. As we have set our hope on thee. Lord, teach me thy statutes. How necessary to understand thy commandments. Blessed are thou, Holy One, in life, tend me with thy precepts. Thy mercy, O Lord, endureth forever. 
O oh, forgot that the works of thy hands, to thee belongeth worship, to thee belongeth praise, to thee belongeth glory, to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto ages. Let us complete our evening prayer unto the Lord. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O God, by thy grace. That the whole evening may be perfect, holy, peaceful, and sinless, let us ask of the Lord. An angel of peace, a faithful guide, a guardian of our souls and bodies, let us ask of the Lord. Pardon and remission of our sins and transgressions, let us ask of the Lord. All things that are good and profitable for our souls and peace for the world, let us ask of the Lord. That we may complete the remaining time of our life in peace and repentance, let us ask of the Lord. A Christian ending to our life, painless, blameless, and peaceful, and a good defense before the dread judgment seat of Christ, let us ask. Commemorating our most holy, most pure, most blessed and glorious Lady Theotokos and ever Virgin Mary with all the saints, let us commend ourselves and each other and all our life unto Christ our God. For thou art a good God and lovest mankind, and unto thee do we send up glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Peace be unto all. Let us bow our heads unto the Lord. O Lord our God, let us bow the heavens and come down for the salvation of mankind. Look upon thy servants and thine inheritance, for unto thee the fearful judge who yet lovest mankind. Have thy servants bow their heads and submissively incline their necks, awaiting not help from man, but entreating thy mercy and looking confidently for thy salvation. Guard them at all times, both during this present evening and in the approaching night, from every foe, from all adverse powers of the devil, and from vain thoughts and evil imaginations. Blessed and most glorified be the might of thy kingdom of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages.
For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages. Blessed 
Blessed be he who is Christ our God, always, now, and ever, and unto ages of ages. Most holy Theotokos, save us. Glory to thee, O Christ, God, our hope. Glory to thee. May he who rose from the dead, Christ our true God, through the prayers of his most pure mother, of the holy and all honorable apostles of St. Innocent, the patron of this community, of the holy higher martyr John of Chicago, whom we commemorate today, of the holy righteous ancestors of God, Joachim and Anna, and of all the saints, have mercy on us and save us, for he is good and loveth mankind. Christ is in our midst. He is in our midst. 